trees as well, leaves. Do they eat kind of fruit? I don't know. Okay, let's have a look at the monkeys. Okay. Yeah, Mum, what's that hand bite? That hand means that if you put your hand in the cage, they could bite it. They're very dangerous animals. Oh, look, is there someone? Look, there's someone over there swinging. Kellyanne, can you see those? Look, over there, can you see the baby ones? Can you see them? Oh, they're really going mad. He's playing on that tire. Look. Look at his great long nose. Oh, look, he's saying hello. 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 <laughs> oh, <laughs> he's trying to kiss me. <laughs> can you see his ears as well up there, Kelly? Oh, yeah. I mean, I can see his eyes. You've got to stroke his nose, Kelly. Mum, why have you got his face that you can't do? Isn't it hard? He's got yeah. hard skin, hasn't he? Yeah. This is a camel and they're very, very special because they've got two humps on their back. The humps are for keeping water. We'll see all those animals at the zoo tomorrow, Carl. You might do, Poppy. You. <laughs> oh, I'll, I'll go. You. We liked those animals, didn't we, Penguin? Mm. Some of them were your friends. Yes, they were splashing about in the water, catching fish. Mm. I'd like to catch a fish. <laughs> Hello. Hello, Hello Poppy. Poppy. Hello. <gasps> oh, look. What are all your animals doing out, Poppy? Oh, Carl and I have been talking about zoos, <laughs> mm, haven't we, Carl? Yep. Because Grandpa Jones is taking me to the zoo tomorrow. Mm. Oh, we know, mm. because he's taking me as well. <laughs> me too. <laughs> Sounds like Grandpa Jones has promised to take you all to the zoo. Yes. Mm. That'll be fun. Mm. Mm. Yes, won't it be exciting? <laughs> we could all go together. Mm. <laughs> Are we going to the zoo now, uh, Carl? No, 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 no. Oh, Poppy, we're not going till tomorrow. Thank you. I wish it was tomorrow today. Mm. I know. Why don't we use all Poppy's toy animals to make our own zoo? Oh, that's a great idea. And we could all be zookeepers. Oh, yes. yes. Oh, come on, Carl, you can help. <laughs> yes, come on. Thanks very much. Come on. There we go, Peggy. Be careful. Don't spill any. No, I won't. There oh. we go. Brilliant. There you go. <laughs> Great. Look. A pool fit for a penguin to swim in. <laughs> oh, oh, can we put the penguins in now, no, please? No, 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 not yet. Why? No, because you see, well, penguins don't just live in the water, do they? What else do they live on? Um, oh, I know rocks. On rocks. the rocks. Oh, yes. I'll see, on the rocks. So we need oh, some right. rocks for the penguins to jump around on mm. and climb on. Hang on a second. Oh, all right, then. Oh, here we go. Got some blocks down here, blocks. some big building blocks. Oh, they'll there. enjoy there's, those. There's one. There's another. Ooh. Okay, I think we're ready. Why? Here we go. <laughs> put him in there on the rock. Oh, brilliant! Look, look at that. that. Let's put some more in. <laughs> Come on, let's put them all in. <laughs> there we go. Put him on the rock. Should we? Should we give one a swim? Oh yes. Let's let him have a swim in there. There we go. Carl, there. Yeah, there's another yeah. big one. I know what penguins like to eat. What? Oh, so do I. So do, yeah, fish. 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 Mm. Who said fish? Have you got any sardines? This can be the elephant's house. Mm. 
Oh, don't be silly, Peggy. Elephants don't have houses. Well, they do at the zoo. Oh. It's called the Elephant's House. Oh. Shall we make them windows with little curtains like my flat? No, 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 no Poppy. They don't have windows and curtains no. and things. Oh. No, you see, animals need special places to live. And big animals, like elephants, well, they need lots of space to roam around mm. in, like in the wild. Um, what are we going to feed our elephants on? Oh, well, they like um, fruit and vegetables and hay. Oh, mm. oh yes, and peanuts. That's right, mm -hmm. yeah. So what other animals have you got in the zoo? Uh, bears. Mm. I've done them. Mm. Can we come and see? Mm. Yeah. Come, come on, on then. <laughs> no! <Yeah>. Poppy! You <laughs> can't put the bears in a cage. Why? Well, you see, they need lots of space, just like the elephants. And they need trees to scratch and climb. And they need grass to roll around in. Oh. I'll make them some trees then, shall That's I? That's a good mm. idea, Poppy. I tell you what. Right. You do that, cos I've got something to do in the kitchen. Right. Mm. Sorry, bears. Oh, be careful, Why? Mm. See if you can get him to hang by his tail, oh. Why? Oh, there we are, little monkey. Now you can climb the tree and swing from the top branches. And we've got lots of toys for you to play with. Hmm. I wonder if Carl's got any bananas. Mm. Oh, yeah. Mm. 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 Hello. I'm just making some animal biscuits that are a surprise for Poppy, Peggy and Why. Put them in the oven. Come on! Oops, Come on. better hide these quick. <laughs> Carl? Yes? What are you doing? Uh, nothing. Oh, good, because we wanted you to come and see our zoo. Yes, right. we want you to be our first visitor. Right, I'll be right there. Hmm. Right. Right. I'll put them in the oven. Carl? No. Yes? You coming? I'm just coming, Poppy. Hmm. I don't think she saw them. Oh, good afternoon, sir. Good afternoon. Have you come to visit our zoo? Oh, I have, yes. Would you like a ticket? Well, I would, yes. Oh, that's 25p, please. Oh, can I pay you later? No. Oh, all right, then. Well, look, there's your ticket. Oh, thank you very much. Now, sir, our head keeper... Hello. <laughs> no. hmm? Poppy, we'll show you round our exhibition. Mm, she'll be your guide. Oh, thank you. Now then, don't feed the animals. Nope. And don't stick your fingers in their mouths. OK. Mm. Come on. Be guided. I will. Mm. <laughs> <laughs> Monkey. <laughs> Come on. <laughs> <laughs> trees, aren't they? <laughs> Penguins. They like fish, you know. Mm. Morning. See? <laughs> Elephants. <laughs> stomp, stomp. <laughs> Come on. Hiss. It's a... Snake. Sna I was supposed to say that I'm head keeper. <laughs> Pieces of eight. Pieces of eight. He's a good actor, isn't he? He mm. is. Now, that was a brilliant zoo. Mm, yeah. Hey, I was a bit frightened of that grizzly bear, though. Oh, no, God. You don't need to be frightened. It's only my teddy. I mm. know. Yeah, hey, and you've worked so hard at being zookeepers <gasps> that I've got a surprise for you. <gasps> Wait there. <gasps> oh, I wonder what it is. Oh, I thought Carl was up to something in the kitchen. Mm. There was a funny sweet smell. Mm. Here we go. <gasps> oh, 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 biscuits. <laughs> oh, oh, look, there's a lion. Yep. Oh, yes, oh, could I have the fish, please? Oh, yeah. I yeah. love biscuits. I love them. Could I have the elephant, please? You can, why? But while we're waiting for these to cool down, mm. I've got a story for you. Oh, oh. And it's all about a zoo a very long time ago. Oh. But it's not a very nice zoo. Oh. And the animals don't like it there. Oh. Right. Are we ready? Yeah, I'm yes. ready. It's called the Great Zoo Escape. Once there was a bird called Ruffles. He lived on a tiny desert island in the middle of the ocean. All the birds on the island liked Ruffles because he made them laugh. <laughs> <laughs> he was always 
They are, aren't they? He was always telling them stories about his adventures in far-off lands. The other birds knew he'd made them up, for Ruffles had never been off the island. No. <laughs> One day, a man rode up to the island in a little boat. Silently, he crept through the trees. The birds did not hear him. Oh. They were all listening to Ruffles, telling them one of his tall stories. Mm. Suddenly, Ruffles found himself struggling inside a net. No. no! He was trapped. The man put Ruffles into a crate and rowed to a big ship that was oh. anchored nearby. Yeah. The other birds looked on helplessly. There was nothing they could do. As the ship sailed away, Ruffles gazed back at the island until it was out of sight. Oh. Then he looked around the ship and saw the other birds and animals in cages like his. Mm. So the zoo man got you too, said a friendly giraffe. Mm. He'll put you in the zoo with the rest of us. He won't. I'll escape, cried Ruffles. But the giraffe shook his head sadly. <gasps> no one ever escapes from the zoo. Oh, can't look at the animals There's in a kangaroo cage. there. Yeah. Yeah. Yes. There's a water buffalo. Oh, yeah, look. And a rhinoceros. Lots, Lots of them, isn't there? Mm. Ruffles and the other animals sailed on and on. All the way across the ocean, Ruffles gazed at the sky and longed for home. Mm. At last, the ship docked at a big port and the birds and animals were unloaded and taken to the zoo. The zoo man put Ruffles in a cage. He was terrified. No. Soon he was surrounded by faces, all staring at him and laughing. He'd never felt so lonely in his life. One day, a seagull sat on his cage. Ruffles begged her to send word to his friends across the sea. The message was passed from one seagull to another until it reached the island. Well, that's clever. <laughs> at once, the three birds who were best and strongest at flying set out on the long journey across the sea to rescue Ruffles. The birds flew for many days and nights. They never stopped to rest until they came to the zoo. Mm -hmm. When he saw his friends swooping down from the sky, Ruffles cried out for joy. I knew you'd come, he said. Quick, get the keys from the zoo and unlock my cage. The zoo man's fast asleep. Mm -hmm. Oh, look at that lion in the little tiny cage. Yes. Yes. No. Doesn't look very happy, does it? No. 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 The three birds tiptoed into the zoo man's office. Gently, they eased the keys out of his pocket and unlocked Ruffles' cage. Good. Mm -hmm. He hopped out, delighted to be free again, but he refused to leave the zoo until he'd opened all the other cages. Mm -hmm. <laughs> there was such a roaring and trumpeting and squeaking among the animals that the zoo man woke up, but it was too late. The animals were free Yay! and Ruffles and his friends had flown. Mm -hmm. As they made the long journey back to the island, the four birds told each other their adventures. At last, they saw the island ahead of them. All the birds came running out to welcome Ruffles and his brave rescuers. Mm -hmm. The island was a happy place once more. Ruffles made the other birds laugh, just as he used to. Do. And he told his favourite story over and over mm -hmm. again. Mm -hmm. But this time, the story was true. Yeah. Oh. <laughs> Yeah. Mm. Mm. Wasn't a very nice zoo, was it? No, no. not like ours. No, no. 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 Wasn't a lot of room for the animals. There was wasn't, there? Poppy. No. no, there wasn't. Can we play those again? Well, I, I don't think we've got time, actually, Poppy. Oh, oh. oh. oh no, we haven't, because there's the bus bell. Oh, but tomorrow we can go to the real zoo. <gasps> oh, yes. yes, with Grandpa Jones. <laughs> I'd almost forgotten. Oh. Bye. Bye bye, bye. wife. Bye bye, bye, -bye Teddy. Bye. bye. <laughs> Carl. What? Look, they've not eaten their biscuits. <laughs> Do you think I should eat them for them? Well, I think we should put them in your lunchbox for tomorrow, Poppy. How about that? Oh, yes, OK, Carl, good idea. Mm. I like feeding time at the zoo. Mm. There, now you sit there, Teddy. Mm. I've got all my toys in bed with me. Mm. Look, I've got Teddy and my penguins and my elephants. And my monkey. Mm. Oh, and Rog, of course. Mm. He's right next to me. Mm -hmm. Do you know where we're going tomorrow, Rog? Yes. Grandpa's taking us to the zoo tomorrow. Zoo tomorrow. Zoo tomorrow. <sighs> Grandpa's taking us to the zoo tomorrow. We can stay all day. 